Good afternoon, everyone. We are doing a random live today because this week we have been talking about basal body temperature tracking and natural birth control. So I wanted to pop on and talk about a product that I use every single day um, that is really, really helpful for women when they're trying to get accurate basal body temperatures. So just to recap a little bit of what we've been talking about, uh, I use basal body temperature tracking to track hormones and women's menstrual cycles uh, so that we can either help women become pregnant, figure out what's going on with their cycle, or so that we can actually avoid pregnancy. So one of the ways that you do that is by taking your basal body temperature every morning, but there's some reasons why you might not be getting very accurate basal body temperatures. And so uh, one of those reasons is if you are not getting four hours of consecutive sleep or you're not temping at the same time each morning. So uh, if that is you, uh, especially relevant if you are um, postpartum, um, if you're breastfeeding, if you're doing shift work. So this is a device, I've got like some rogue hair happening. This is a device called TempDrop. And TempDrop is what I call a wearable basal body temperature tracker. So TempDrop is, this little droplet type of shape. You can see that there is a sensor and you wear this, this is an armband, you wear this on your arm. So uh, this is how you put it on. It's really comfortable. You put it in between your two muscles here, uh, which, you can, which you can palpate, touch on yourself. And it sits in the groove and you just wear it just like this. And what you do is you put it on uh, before you go to bed. And uh, this can be any time. This can be when you are brushing your teeth before bed. This can be when you're cuddling with your partner while you're in bed and reading. This can be during sex. This can be, um, you know, as soon as you guys go upstairs and start your bedtime routine, uh, the, the, the time that you put it on doesn't matter but the key is remembering it. So once you get the device on, you press the button to turn it on and it will flash to notify you that it's on. And then you wear it all night and um, it's very comfortable. You keep it on one arm uh, consistently when you're doing your charting. And uh, the, what, what the device does is it will take your basal body temperature all throughout the night and it does it with the uh, electrode uh, which is just like an electrode that you would put under your tongue for taking your your basal body temperature in the morning with a just regular basal body temperature thermometer. And it monitors your temperature all throughout the night. And it also has some technology in it that will uh, track movement and track different sleep patterns. And you don't necessarily go into that data and use it, but it helps the device figure out when you are awake and when you're asleep. So when you wake up in the morning and you take the armband off, uh, what you do is you sync it with your phone. There's an app called the TempDrop app, which stores your temperatures, and you have to sync the device with your phone via Bluetooth, and then you get the temperature for the day, and then you also get more accurate temperatures updated for the previous days, because what the device does is it learns your sleep patterns over time, which is really great. So, you know, say you are, um, you know, feeling really hot because you're on your cycle, um, really hot in temperature, um, or you're having some restless sleep, the, the device will monitor that and filter out any um, sort of noise so that it can give you an accurate temperature. So once you sync it in the morning, it will give you a temperature and that's the temperature that you end up putting into your chart um, in whatever app that you've chosen or whatever um, type of paper chart that you're doing. And uh, that is the temperature. And so it, it learns you over time. Uh, and um, what else do I wanna say about TempDrop? It's really, really nice, especially for women that don't wake up at the same time every day. They're able to do their basal body temperatures easily. Um, it's also really great for any woman that has interrupted sleep. So <clears throat> I like TempDrop and works really well for me because 
it's no fuss, I don't have to wake up at the same time um, every morning, and sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night uh, just with varying cortisol levels or um, different stressors that I'm under. So I needed something that was really consistent. So I've been using Temp Drop for um, over, I think this is my 21st cycle using Temp Drop to learn about my, learn about my cycle. And it has been, <clears throat> excuse me, completely life-changing. And I recommend the device to all of my, all of my, um, friends, all of my patients, just because, uh, I find that basal body temperature tracking is just really amazing for truly assessing number one what's going on with your cycles and your period but also it helps you get to a certain goal whether you're using the device to help uh, help you chart for natural birth control or whether you are actually trying to figure out when in your cycle <coughs> excuse me I got tickle my throat or whether you're actually looking in your cycle to figure out when is the best time to time sex for uh, pregnancy. So it works a lot of different ways. Um, the device is not expensive, unlike other devices out there like the Daisy, um, which is a very popular one, or Femtech or um, Lady Comp. Uh, those are all very pricey. Uh, the temp drop, depending on which type of like warranty package you get, is less than $200 or around $200. Um, and all you have to do is replace the battery. Uh, and it also doesn't have any sort of EMF release when you sleep. Uh, the only EMF that happens with the device is when you sync it uh, with Bluetooth in the morning. Obviously, that's, that's the only downside about Bluetooth these days. Um, but it's really, really easy to use. It has one button. Um, if you don't like the armband, there are many women um, in the Temp Drop Facebook group that actually make different types of armbands because sometimes the armbands work better for different sized arms um, and everybody has different preferences. But the really cool thing about this device, one thing that I, another thing that I like about it is that it was developed by um, a couple in Israel uh, because they wanted to do a fertility awareness method and basal body temperature tracking for, um, uh, for, for her uh, so that they could, you know, learn about her cycles and, and avoid pregnancy or to become pregnant. But she was having, you know, an uninterrupted or interrupted sleep and she couldn't, uh, she couldn't get accurate uh, temperatures or enough sleep to really use basal body temperature tracking as a method and so uh, they ended up creating temp drop which is a wearable thermometer uh, to help women like her that had interrupted sleep and there goes the rogue hair again uh, that had interrupted sleep uh, be able to use fertility awareness method for uh, either conception or for avoiding pregnancy. So I really like how it's a small company and their mission is just super solid. They really want to just help women, uh, you know, chart better and be able to figure out what's going on with their hormones, which you guys all know is kind of my biggest thing. Uh, and uh, it's just something super, super easy. Um, the other thing that I will mention about Temp Drop is that uh, it's not like other devices out there, like the Daisy. Um, I'm harping about harping on the Daisy because the Daisy is a device that's actually really, really popular and is quite expensive. It's in the three to four hundred dollar range. Um, but the reason why I don't recommend Daisy for patients and for cycle tracking is because Daisy is what we call a predictive. Uh, piece of technology. The same thing with the app Natural Cycles. Uh, they are specifically designed to uh, <clears throat> record and take your temperature, but then they take that data and extrapolate out and predict when you're going to ovulate, when you're going to bleed, when you're going to have um, XYZ occur in your cycle. And we don't want that, even though that's technically helpful to have a device tell us that. The issue with that is that our bodies are very, very different each cycle in terms of the exact day that we ovulate on, when our cervical mucus starts to happen, when we actually get our period. Even if you are a woman with rock solid cycles, it, things still vary by hours, by days uh, in, in your menstrual cycle. And so, <clears throat> 
we don't want to rely on a method that is predictive to tell us when we are fertile or not or when we can have unprotected sex or when we cannot so that's what I don't like about daisy and natural cycles is that they will actually say, oh, this is a green day. This is an okay day to have unprotected sex, but it's based off of the data that it's taken from past cycles and every cycle is gonna be different. Every menstrual cycle is gonna be different for women. So we wanna have a device like the temp drop that is going to be uh, just data. It's just going to give you data and then you take that data, you put it into a chart, and then you use a method to interpret that chart to then determine what you do. Whether you have unprotected sex that day, whether you are getting close to ovulation, you want to time sex to get pregnant, um, and you know that's that's just what makes temp drop really good is that it's just giving you data and you have to use and interpret that data. And it's really easy, just slide it off. And that's it. And one cool thing that I really like, which is kind of fun, is you have to turn it on when you, when you put it on at night before you go to bed, but you don't actually have to turn it off because it's smart enough to sense your body temperature, obviously, because that's what it's doing. But as the sensor cools down, the device actually turns off. So I didn't turn this on when I just slipped it on. Uh, because I only put this on at night, but uh, I just think that's really cool. So temp drop is a really great alternative for if you can't do oral basal body temperatures uh, for whatever reason, whether you're a shift worker um, or you're postpartum breastfeeding and you're waking up in the middle of the night, you're not getting four hours of consecutive sleep, or you're the type of person that doesn't wake up at the same time every day, um, I would definitely recommend a wearable thermometer like temp drop. And there's really no other product out there that is like temp drop. So um, it's kind of the only one, uh, but it's really, really changed my life. I, f I feel like menstrual cups and temp drop are kind of the most revolutionary uh, products for women out there. At least I can only speak about my experience, but I know that my patients that I have converted to or recommended temp drop to and recommended menstrual cups, they're like, oh my gosh, life changing. So wanted to share that with you. Um, I am not affiliated with TempDrop, I guess, in any way, though I do have an affiliate link, but I make, I haven't made any, any money from it per se, because I don't necessarily always talk about my affiliations. But um, if you guys want a link that can save you some money, then just let me know and I'll send it to you. Um, I'm not into using TempDrop because I'm an affiliate. I, I use it because it works for me and it's really, really helpful for a lot of women. So if you want a discount, let me know. But uh, otherwise, I recommend TempDrop for helping women basal body temperature track accurately in order to track their cycles, in order to become pregnant naturally, or in order to avoid uh, pregnancy. So if you have any questions, let me know.